I don't remember who won the Heisman in 1999, and that's because it should have been this guy. And tonight, he's a Georgia Sports Hall of Famer. Ah, yeah, Tony. Oh, wow, I was right. This is this is exciting. This is very, very exciting. Uh, you don't get to a stage like this where I'm at now without having to some people to thank. Uh, first and foremost, I would like to thank uh, my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Without him, none of this. I mean, none of this is possible. Uh, I think he deserves a round of applause for us right now. Uh, I also want to thank uh, my beautiful wife, uh, Kenya. Raise your hand, sweetie, please, because uh, I did not play a single down yet before um, I swept her off of her feet. She, she did not let me get along or get by fast before she kind of not uh, tied me up and made sure I didn't get away. And what, what that, what, why that is so important to me is because it was her encouragement, her words, her never getting up. We, we studied together. We talked together during you know, tough times. Um, I don't think at, at any point that she realized how good I was until my career was over in college, until I actually went to Tampa. That's how supportive she was and just caring about me the person. So I thank you for being there. And I also thank you for uh, mothering, uh, being nurturing to our kids, Skylar and Caden. I would thank them, but they didn't have anything to do with me in college. But right now, they, they're very supportive. I'm honored right now to uh, have them here, uh, have them a part of this moment. That's very, very, very important to me. My mom and my dad. My mom and my dad has been so, so, so special uh, in college, college, I mean in high school as well. One game. One game, and I think that game was up in Boston College, and the only reason they missed that game, I think that I wanted to save some tickets or so share tickets in college, which you do. You only get a lot of, like, four tickets, and I think one of my teammates needed one more ticket or a couple more tickets, and I asked Mom and Dad, can you kind of, kind of not come this game because I wanted to save a ticket up for, I think it was maybe Georgia Tech, I mean Georgia versus Georgia, or some game later on in that season that I wanted to ask some teammates for, and that's the only game they're missing. All the support the traveling and encouraging words. Y'all were always there, and I, I'm very, very appreciative, very, very appreciative. I also have here my aunt uh, and uncle, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Alex Hammersham. They were there as well. That support when you come out of the locker room or you come out of a game where sometimes you get booed, three, four interceptions, and nobody's willing to support you, and you can go into some arms and go into some people only asking, what do you want to eat? That is very, very, very important. <laughs> I also want to uh, thank my teammates. My, uh, you, you don't play the game of quarterback without having somebody to really care about you, really protecting you, um, giving their all. I wasn't always the, the, the easiest to get along because I wanted to win. I'm a competitor, uh, and I've tried to just lead by example, but sometimes you rub guys the, the, the wrong way. I remember when I got inducted to the College Football Hall of Fame that my teammates were calling, calling me, and they said that we got in. I'm like, wow, that feels so good. Not only that, I was getting in, and it was one of my honors, but they they also felt like they were getting in, they were a part of the whole journey, and that felt so, so special. I would like to thank the Institute of Technology for also taking a chance on a little scrawny kid from South Carolina. Thank you. Um, I see uh, Mr. Homer Rice back there. He was the athletic director when I was here. He started a total person program that really got me going to where we were not only football players, but we were – you know, our impact players, we were skilled players, we wanted an impact society, and I still carry that along with me today. I also want to uh, congratulate the, the inductees, my new teammates, it's, it's not easy. Uh, I'm just so thankful and honored to be here, so, so thankful. And, I, and when I got the call as well to be in the Hall of Fame, um, my initial thoughts were, why? Why me? Why at this point? And it was pretty clear now that at this point, it was about service. It was about using the platform to uh, time, energy, money, if it's that, encouragement, all those type of things. And I challenge each and every one of us in here today, whatever platform you have, whatever resources you can give to help one another to do things for somebody other than yourselves, make sure you do that. I'm very, very thankful for the Georgia Sports Hall of Fame again and everybody here. Thank you.